Britain's top diplomat flew into Israel Sunday to set out his new government's foreign policy stance. On his schedule are meetings with Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu and Palestinian Authority Chief Mahmoud Abbas. But his first public statement was due to events in the United States. I condemn the political violence that we saw in the United States overnight. It's horrendous. On Monday, Lamy is set to meet with his Israeli counterpart, Israel Katz, and President Isaac Herzog before the obligatory visit to the Yad Vashem Holocaust Memorial. In many policy areas, the incoming Labour government has signalled a continuation of conservative positions. And new Prime Minister Keir Starmer has fought to remove the accusation of anti-Semitism associated with his party during the stewardship of Jeremy Corbyn. But the new administration may be more critical of Israel. I want to get back to a balanced position uh, on Israel-Gaza. We've been very clear that we want to see a ceasefire. We want to see those hostages out. But when we see the tremendous loss of life, 38,000 people, women and children, the fighting has to stop. The aid has got to get in. It is considering dropping British objections to ICC arrest warrants against Israeli leaders filed under the previous UK government. Lamy has previously expressed support for recognizing Palestine as a state as part of efforts to achieve a two-state solution.